why? Well, just have a look at this. I mean, this city is beautiful. I had seen pictures before, and when I got here, I was like, I was amazed. It was even better than the expectations. When thinking about, you know, immersing yourself in a culture, I want to be completely lost in it. I don't want to know what the people are saying all the time. I want to be a little bit lost, feel a little bit confused and out of my element. And just sort of, it's smaller, so you always, you really feel like you're at home. You really get a grasp on the local scene here, and you know where you're going, and you know, know where you live, and you don't have to worry about taking taxis and stuff. It's all just very condensed. So when I looked at the pictures on Google, it seems very, very nice. The beach, and it's so close to the water. For me, it's very important to be close to nature. One of my uh, dad's friends had told me that, that his best experience from college were, were the six months abroad. Um, and so, and so what I said, what I thought, and, and what my dad thought as well, was instead of six months, why don't we just do all four years? And so knowing that I would at least want to study a semester here in Spain, uh, we decided that I would come here and, and do all four years and really you know, do the full immersion and, uh, and really live the culture day to day. It's really good because the school is a little bit like smaller than I'm used to, which means that you're gonna have like more like smaller classes so you're gonna be closer to your classmates they're gonna be like friends and the teachers they're really informal you can like talk to them about whatever and they're they don't mind if you're just like not in their office after class so i can really see people that i know a lot of times so i can like say hi to people i know yeah so and i also think that the teacher is very good and be helping me a lot and they're for people, for Erasmus students, they really, really help you and they offer, like, I, I can have more time during exams and they offer me, yeah, if you want to bring a dictionary, you can do that. You can also answer the questions in English. I do really like studying at, at Tech Noon now. Everyone's there, it's really nice, especially to, to foreigners and it's a good time. So I just feel like, you know, at home in the university, like the security guards are always saying, Good morning, you know, they know everyone, all the Erasmus students by name, and I don't know, I just never have felt really lost. What really sets this university apart is its mentoring program, um, and, it, and it sets you up with, with one, either a, a, a researcher at Thate or a professor at Technum, and they, and, they, and they guide you through your first year to make sure you're understanding everything, to make sure you're in line with everything you need to be doing. And so that's what really sets it apart from uh, any other place. Memory is probably going to be one day we're like, we're studying for this exam we had the last, the day after. And instead of studying in the library, we went actually to this beach and played a little bit beach volleyball between uh, studying. One of the main reasons also why I chose San Sebastian is because of the food. The, the culture, the food culture is amazing here and I really love this pinchos uh, thing with the small dish where you can choose because I usually never decide, I can never decide what I want to eat. So here I can choose one among a different, different courses. Yes, I do. I love San Sebastian and I love Spain because coming from California you know, I feel like everything's so fast-paced. But when you're here, you have things like siestas. You have things such as, you have the option of just sitting outside and enjoying like a good meal. And I think there's that importance of just connections. You always feel like you're connected to complete strangers. People are always engaging in conversations with you. Quiero aprender cómo hablar sin problemas el castellano. Entonces, sí, es una... Bien lugar, lugar para hacer esto. Sí. What it has that, that I feel New York misses is, you know, history and, and strong rooted culture, um, which is which, which you see in, uh, day to day, and it's it's fascinating. Just is nicer and and just happier because look at this place, it's unbelievable. Um, I don't really want to leave. I'm getting used to it and, and every day I'm learning something new and, uh, and I couldn't be happier. I'm probably going to go back though. So yeah, I would definitely recommend it. I was lucky enough to have someone that told me about the experience and it made me really realize that I wanted to do it, but a lot of people sort of wish they could and they never get around to it. But I'd like to say that it's been 100% worth it and it's been life-changing 
and I feel like it should be required for every student to study abroad because it can really, really change your perspective on the world and how in your place in it.